This is 1158C, where they want you to find the volume and surface area of a square pyramid. So first I'm gonna draw my shape. I've got my square, and then my apex. Draw your shapes. All right, so the diagram tells me that the edge of the square is seven, and because the base is a square, all the sides are gonna be seven. It also tells me that the height which always drops down and creates a right angle, is nine. So H equals nine. Um, in order to find the volume of a square pyramid, or any pyramid, you're gonna do base area times height, and you are gonna have to divide by three because that is one third of a prism. So base area, because it's a square, the area of a square is side times side or base times height. So seven times seven, the height is nine. And if I divide that number by three, I'm going to get the answer 147 centimeters cubed. So let's find the surface area. So the surface area is adding all the faces together, right? All the areas of the faces together. So if you draw a net, sometimes that's easier for students to visualize. And so we've got our square base and then we have our four triangular faces that are all congruent to each other. So I know because this is a square, seven, 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 and the area of the square is 49, right? Seven times seven is 49. So let's start with that, that's pretty easy. Then we know that because there are four triangular faces, I can just find the area of one and multiply by four. So the area of a triangle is base times height. Now, unfortunately, we don't know the height of this triangle. We know the height of the pyramid is nine, but this length right here is actually the slant height, right? It's this length right here that's coming down from the apex to the edge. Now, remember from the last lesson that in order to find the slant height, you usually have to create a right triangle using the height of the pyramid and half the base. So the height of a pyramid is nine, half of seven is 3.5, which would make my slant height. Well, I have to use a Pythagorean theorem to figure that out. So nine squared plus 3.5 squared equals my slant height squared. Add those together and take the square root and you're gonna get about 9.66 for your slant height. Okay, so now I do have enough information to figure out the area of this triangle. The base is seven, the height is 9.66, and because it's a triangle, I wanna divide by two. Plug this information into your calculator and you are gonna get approximately 184.24 centimeters squared for your surface area.